have strong. We have unicorn meat. Bye, Charlie. Goodbye? What? Oh, yeah. What happened? Oh, they took my freaking kidney. So I have a bunch of questions. Like, who packaged this? Where did it come from? Why is it even a thing? <laughs> like, I don't understand. I don't know if I'm sad or mad. I'm like filled with many emotions. <laughs> it's an excellent source of sparkles. So, you know, if you're low on your daily sparkle intake, you might want to try this. Product of Ireland. Okay, yeah, well, Ireland is where the unicorns live, so that only makes sense. They're not gonna be living there much longer, apparently, because um, they're being packaged in cans. I don't think it's real. Like, we all know unicorns are real, but I don't think people are going around butchering them. I won't be getting this, would you? Oh my God, here we have meat shredder claws. What the heck? It says, it has a little blurb, you know, in case you're a little confused on these Wolverine hands. So the surprisingly efficient way of shredding your meat has the added bonus of making you feel like a Wolverine. I'm not gonna lie, like usually you just, like shred your meat normally, this is a fun and exciting way to do it. Like I am behind the meat shredder claws. It would make dinner time more fun. You know, you get to feel like you're a superhero. And I will say Wolverine's always been like one of my favorite characters and the X-Men movies are so good. So yeah, you can just like act it out and pretend you're him while you're watching the movie. But then also that could be a really bad and dangerous thing and you would like accidentally shred, like get somebody or shred something. So yeah, maybe um maybe just leave these for the meat and don't play with them. Oh my goodness. So 1500 live ladybugs is sold on Amazon. Never would have guessed that. <laughs> okay, so by the company Good Bugs Ladybugs, guaranteed live delivery, you know, that's good. <laughs> Imagine, you just get, <laughs> First of all, I don't even know why you need 1,500 live ladybugs, but imagine you get 1,500 dead ladybugs. Like then there's really nothing you can do with them. So it's good that they guarantee live delivery, you know? But how does someone even obtain this many ladybugs? Like if I see ladybugs, it's like a single ladybug just like buzzing by or like perched on a little leaf. I've never seen like a handful of ladybugs in one setting. So this must be a ladybug farmer and they're just like harvesting them and getting them ready for sale. Like I have a lot of questions for this ladybug company. And then it says ladybugs are good bugs, great for kids, birthday parties and school projects. I, how they're marketing it, this is just like all over the place. Yeah, I don't know about this. Hey guys, welcome back to Kickback and React. I'm your host, Court. Today we are talking about the weirdest items you can buy on Amazon. Let's get started. Okay, here's something I'm not getting behind, the instant underpants. Just add water. And you only get one pair, like, come on, man. <laughs> so instant underpants, need an extra pair of briefs? Got a bottle of water? If so, problem solved. This novelty item is small enough to fit in the palm of your hand, but it packs a big punch when you find yourself in a tricky situation. Well, that's good to know. <laughs> oh my gosh, so literally, it's just like this little ball of material, and then you add water to it, and it just like forms into these underpants. Would you wear them? I know I wouldn't. And if you're adding water, wouldn't they be soaking wet? Who wants to put on soaking wet underwear? Like this is supposed to be for if you're in a pinch and you need a new pair of underwear like right away. Who wants to put on soggy wet underwear? Yeah, this, this isn't it. Okay. Um, I'm more of a dog person than a cat person, so maybe it's just me. But let me know down in the comments if you are partial to cats, if this is appealing to you. Because I don't like it. I just prefer a regular tissue box to get my tissue, not a cat's booty hole. So what on earth cat butt tissue holder? Orange tabby cat fits square tissue box. It's $104. Okay, now I'm really not on board. You're paying $104 for this weird cat that has like tissues coming out of its butt. Like, no, not worth it. It's not even like, you know how some things you get, it's just like as a joke, it's just to be funny. This is just weird. <laughs> oh, and they have another cat. Okay, so this is $104, but if you get the black and white cat, it's 107. Like, why are you even charging more than anything over $20 for this? That's what I wanna know. So it says, these kitties love to help. Keep your tissues close at hand with the help of your trusty feline friend. Humorous tissue holder. Yeah, it's not that funny. It's just weird. <laughs> <laughs> Let me know down in the comments if you like it, because personally, I just, it's not for me. I'm not a fan. Oh my gosh, bacon bandages. Now I've seen everything. 
So there's a free prize inside. Maybe it's a piece of raw bacon. Ooh, <laughs> just slap that on your skin apparently. 14.30 for some bacon bandages. I don't know why someone would want to look like they have a piece of bacon on their skin and they just like don't know it's there. Like that's so embarrassing. Everyone's gonna be coming up to you and be like, Excuse me, um, do, do you know you have bacon on your kneecap? Or do you know you have bacon on your arm? They're gonna be like, yeah, it's my bandage. Like, no. <laughs> It's gonna look like you messy. It's gonna look like you are still hungry because you didn't fully eat all your breakfast. Just avoid the questions, avoid the stares, and just don't get the bacon bandages. I just see so much wrong with this pet butler. So serving this for your animals, one, it's not nice. Your pet does not want to be your little servant at your party. He's going around with a little train on his back. That's not cool. And two, if this dog sees a squirrel, he's gone. Your friggin' celery and your carrots and your cauliflower and your dip, it's gonna be all over the place. It's gonna be all over your guests, all over your clothes. So yeah, just don't buy this and put the um, tray on the table and don't make your pets be little servants. It's not cool. So they're blurb. We know it kinda sorta seems like a good idea, right? No, no it does not. <laughs> Instead of putting Fido to work as your personal butler, let your pet continue to earn its keep with cuddles and companionship. Yes. That's why this gag gift is actually an empty box you can use to prank, okay, unsuspecting pet owner, friends, and family members. I got really heated thinking this was real. I just saw all the problems that came along with it. Usually, I'm a positive, optimistic person. Not with pet butler, I wasn't. <laughs> So it's good that this is literally just a joke because I don't know who would buy this, especially if you're a pet owner, you don't want to do this to your pet. So the fact that it's a gag gift, I, I can get behind that one. <laughs> Lastly, we have, we're ending this on toilet nightlight note. <laughs> So this is just so stupid. Honestly, I don't like this at all. Nobody can deny how practical a night light is for those middle of the night bathroom trips. That being said, do you need a night light in your toilet? <laughs> Maybe these funny and festive lights serve a purpose, especially for those who need a little help with their aim in the dark. There's no way this is gonna work. This is so stupid so i'm all for a night light because like sometimes in the middle of the night you gotta go so i get these little like lights fixtures that plug into the wall they're from bath and body works and they have a scent so you know it's a it's a fun good time this on the other hand they're trying too hard you don't want to be like going to the bathroom and then this neon lights just like shining in your face you know <laughs> maybe it's just me but yeah that i wouldn't be about it oh my god that's just too much like you're not at a club you're in your bathroom. <laughs> well, there you guys have it. That is our list. I hope you enjoyed it. It was definitely an interesting one to make. Let me know down in the comments what you thought, what your favorite product was. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel and click that notification bell so you can get notified whenever we post any new videos. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye. And today we are talking about the weirdest product you can buy on Amazon. Let's get started. Weirdest items you can buy on Amazon. Uh. It looks like you can get smaller amounts. It looks like you can get 150 or 300. You know, if 1500 is a bit too many ladybugs, you can you can lower it down a little bit. <laughs> That's good to know. Um, so it says, nobody can deny how practical a nightlight is for those middle of the night bathroom tricks. Ugh. That being said, you need a nightlight in your toilet. That being said, do you need a nightlight in your toilet? <laughs>